reality, how it is now, and how this reality sounds to me, which is not always beautiful, and but is also not always just noise, but something in between that. Oh man, it's um, it's ecstasy, it's despair, it's everything in between. It's kind of futuristic, you know what I mean? Like, um, it's not. It's not standard, it's not s stiff and robotic, it's more flowing, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> One above minus Bendigo. Wait, what did I say? Oh god, yeah! Minus plus one. Underground, overground, some shit. <laughs> I'm here, man, to play this new record with Lucas. Nah, yeah, just uh, invited here to be part of this ensemble and uh, yeah, excited, man. I think it's a, it's a dope lineup. It's deep, man. Hold on, wait a minute. One above ground, right? Am I right? Am I close? Lucas really just did some weird stuff, which I love. Um, the drums are crazy, which really just attracted me to the track that I'm on. <laughs> There's a lot of like hip hop in it, but it's also, you know, just kind of like the love for experimentation and the love for, for trying to find new sounds, you know what I mean? And, uh, I could appreciate a producer that can kind of get me out of the standard of, you know, what I normally do and make it dope still. So, you know, salute, you know what I'm saying? For sure, I appreciate him. And it's great. It's the stuff that I really just enjoy about music, like all the bends and everywhere that it takes. I'm so glad I didn't blow Lucas off because I have a tendency to blow off emails. But Lucas, I really madly respect, so I felt like I had to contribute. And he just asked for just some raw samples from what I'm working on currently. I was doing some experimentation with different techniques with playing the, the needle nails, and that's what I sent over to him. And then he just did his magic and then alchemically summoned up a song out of the material. just one thing, it's not just noise, it's not just old school hip hop, it's not just new school, it's not just trap or whatever. It's some kind of an improvisation of everything that I like in this moment on a 40 minute record. One above, minus underground, that's my move. I love working with Lucas because he's always got like such a such a groove, you know, he, he's really good at like this kind of wild soundscape and like, you know, harsh noises. But he's as a groovy man, so you know, there's always a certain like Lucasness about it, you know. bringing in like a lot of different styles, a lot of different personalities. It's almost, I think, in the way that he kind of like composed each track to fit a different type of vocalist. I love projects like that where it seems like how do these pieces fit, but there's like a common thread that, you know, that makes it work, you know what I mean? When you're trying to um, get other people to kind of gravitate towards hip hop, you kind of don't want it always to be standard and safe. You kind of want it to be, you know, risky and different. So, um, you know, I could appreciate people that take risks doing stuff like that.
what is very important for this record is that there are so many different people speaking their own voice. But as soon as it comes together, it becomes an own universe of sound, of language. Everybody seems cool, it's free flowing, nobody it doesn't seem stressful. We're able to laugh and joke like we all have known each other for years already. No, no snaps. <laughs> So we're going to play in Krems tomorrow at Donal Festival. Yeah, that's going to happen and I'm really excited. I'm really excited to see, like besides myself playing, I'm really excited to see everybody else who's on this record. How him presenting his music, that, you know, his brain, his brainchild of what the project is and be able to present it to uh, the people and, you know, use us as instruments to uh, project his message that, you know, hey, I'm, I'm here for it, you know, and thankful. It's either going to be amazing or it's going to be awful. And uh, there's something really beautiful about that, like walking that tightrope. I love that. The unknown is what music is all about. So trying to pull it off is, is half the fun. You know what I mean? Stats connect molecules, infect the very essence. What's interpreted as that question actually vital essential lessons? Keep your blessings. We're secular here and we're agnostic. Smart enough to know the lies of a false prophet. So stop it. Your concerns for bad optics leave you blind. From like the first note that Victoria was playing, like I just knew what I was like, oh yeah, this is cool. <laughs> like, I, you, know, you just spoke, it's electric. I'm opening up the whole shebang with uh, 10 minutes of harsh noise. <laughs> just to, you know, set the mood for people. At this point, all of a sudden, it was like, like a relief. Everything worked out super well. The people loved it. The people in the band uh, loved it. The contribution to the canon ain't landing. If time is unreal, why am I moving towards has been? Pop me some aspirin to keep the voices from laughing. They boisterous, they annoyance make me feel like they has been. Zach had to get a light with a match. Get a book life with a scratch. Ignited by the ideas hatched. Peaceful, we tried that for years. Trying to find shade in a world full of sun rays. Just the fact that most of the people who are on this album came for a live presentation to Dona Festival in Krems will stick in my memory forever, I think, because it's one of the biggest gigs I have ever had.